Hello and welcome back to these Paint Shop Pro X6 tutorials. In this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to control the depth of field in your photos. Ok so first of all you need to load up the photo which you want to control the depth of field on and then you need to click adjust and then go down to depth of field. It will then open up this window here. So if you just drag that to the side a bit so you can still see your photo behind and then tick preview on image then it will give you a better view of what you're actually adjusting on here okay so anything which you either put in this circle or another shape is what will be focused on now you can change the area of focus shape just down here you can have a freehand one where you can draw around whatever you want in a freehand way you can have it as a circle so you can just put a circle around something or you can have a square so you can put a square or a box around something so for this I'm going to use the square and my area of focus is these trees here the rest I'm going to have out of focus so to do this you click on the square and then you put your square around what you want to be in focus so it's around that area and then you let go of left click and then you'll see that these have now come into focus and the rest is out of focus OK, so you can change the blur. Now this is the blur on everything which is out of focus. So if you increase this, it will go more blurred. And if you decrease it, it will become more focused. So for example, if I increase this up to 70, you'll see the background is now a lot more blurred. Now if you have it too blurred, then you're going to start to see the shape which you drew around your image. Um, but you can change this with the feather edges and focus ranges. Um, so really you need to just have a play around on here and get it as good as you want it so once you're happy with what you're focused on all you have to do is click OK and that's all you have to do when you're controlling the depth of fields on your photos